Hello. Happy weekend. Hello. Happy weekend. It's probably not the weekend when you see this, but you know, it might be. It There's might. a two in seven chance, so. It's not going to be on the weekend. It's okay. But we're here at the Contemporary. Yes. Because we got brunch. We're going to brunch it up. Um, so if you guys don't know, the California Girl now does brunch on Saturdays and Sundays. And if you don't know what brunch is, it's not breakfast, but it's not lunch, but it's acceptable to drink. Mm -hmm. It's super hard to get reservations, so we checked last night and reservation popped up. So this is what we're going to do, but we're running late. Shocker. So yeah, so we're going to go. We're going to go to a reservation. It was at 12 and ooh, brightness. It's like 12.10 now? Yeah, it's 12.10 now. We did call, they said it was fine, it's not a big deal, but still. So we'll see you at the top. At the top of the world. So we just sat down. This place is gorgeous, it's amazing. Um, we're just about to order our entree, and I'm really excited. Our mimosas are not really mimosas though. It's just really champagne with boba. But I'm not complaining. So, but it is unlimited. And I do look naked right now, and I apologize. I actually am wearing clothes, so that's it. So. I'm going to eat everything. Okay. <laughs> so here's our mimosas we were talking about. So yeah, there's not really like, oh god. There's not really anything like orange about it. It's just literally champagne and boba. And then here is our menu. So we have the self-serve, so that's our buffet style, which me and Colin will come up and show you guys in just a little bit what that's looking like. And then we have the entree selection, so you can pick out an entree. Uh, rumor has it that you can pick out more than one, but we're just gonna go with one. I'm gonna go with the steak and eggs because, I mean, really, what am I ever gonna get steak and eggs ever again? And then brunch drink options. Yeah, overall this looks really amazing and we'll give you a whole tour of the actual buffet of the place. So right when you come in, you will see that you can get mimosas here. This is also other places you can get drinks. And then over here we have the Bloody Mary bar. So this is an additional charge of $10, but you can get a whole bunch of stuff to go inside of it. So it's all pickled. And then we have these lovely people playing music over here. And then we have all the butter you could imagine. Some scones, chocolate croissants, cinnamon, more croissants, cheddar biscuits, oranges. And then the, this is the California Grill Bourbon Baba. It looks amazing. I'm totally gonna have that later. And then over here we have some charcuterie. So of course the meats, cheeses, all the things you can imagine. Some mustard, almonds, pickles. And then over here we have some sushi. Let me see if I can get you guys a better look here. Yeah, sushi over here. Looks so good. And I'm not really a big sushi person, so I'm excited to try some of it. We have a strawberry salad, bacon and egg salad, some quiches, and I heard these are amazing. These are deviled eggs. We've got some parfaits over here, different breads, and then on here we have hard smoked salmon, Greek, bagels, fresh fruit. It's kind of going a little once over over here. More stuff for your parfaits, egg yolk, egg white, smoked salmon. And then this is where they actually prepare the food. So when you order your entree, it actually gets made here and then they'll bring it out to you. So here we have my first plate. So we have the deviled eggs. I got a cheddar biscuit roll, some quiche, charcuterie, cheese, um, California roll. And this lovely person got me some soy sauce which I very much appreciate. You're welcome. What did you get? I got some prosciutto and some uh, ham quiche and some salmon and some pretty much everything that I saw I grabbed. <laughs> so the only thing that I'm really excited about that I did not get was that bourbon thing. That's going to be my next course because I only have one hand. And I was carrying you guys with another, which sounds really weird. And I was carrying the plate with the other hand, so I just didn't have enough hands for that. But it's gonna happen. How are you liking it so far? Everything's amazing and so fancy. It is very fancy. Oh, pinky out, pinky out. <laughs> So, 
Barb's like, oh, Bethany can't wink at all. So when she tries to wink, she blinks, like, with purpose. So her trying to, like, wink at me and letting me know something subtly usually looks like something like this. <laughs> You're not wrong. I'm right. <laughs> And that's been the talks with Colin. So uh, here's the buffet dessert, which looks It's not amazing. a dessert. It has ice cream. It's a dessert. Ice cream all the time. That what? Hashtag ice cream for life. Why are you screaming for life? <laughs> Continue. Okay, uh, apparently it's got some bourbon in it and walnuts and cornflakes and uh, ice cream. It looks delicious. They didn't really give uh, much of a description, or at least, let me rephrase that. They gave a description, but Bethany and I chose to ignore the description because what's life without surprises? It's got a little citrus in it I wasn't expecting. So the food. The food finally came after an hour and a half. I mean, not the most ideal, but at least looks really good. So there's potatoes, steak, eggs, onions, the works. This is a lime aioli over here. And then I got a side of bacon, because bacon's life. What did you get, honey? I got a lobster benedict. <laughs> I uh, were drinking mimosas, so I actually ended up getting an orange juice as well. And now I'm just pouring it in my champagne because it was just straight champagne, honestly. But yeah, we're gonna eat this and hopefully it's good. We'll let you guys know. So it might be a little loud out here because they're blaring the music out here that's inside the restaurant. But this is the view from the little duck they have. And then Grand is right over here. And then we yeah. have that was California Grill for brunch. A lot of fun. A uh, little bit of time. If you're in a hurry, I probably wouldn't suggest going to California Grill. No, it uh, took us two hours. Which is nice. Yeah. I mean, honestly, they didn't rush us through or anything, which is No, nice they really did not rush us. Our actual entree did not show up probably till like an hour, hour and a half. And they did say that they were a little backed up on the kitchen. We came at the end of brunch, not the beginning. So they apparently were really kind of trying to catch up and finish before right. the end of brunch actually happened. But it was very delicious. Lots mm -hmm. of... Uh, High quality luxury foods that you probably don't get in any other places, mm -hmm. especially uh, cooked to that level of expertise. I thought it was good. I don't know if it was worth the price, in my opinion. Just because it was a little bit more expensive and because I thought the entree was gonna come out. I mean, it's my fault, it's not theirs. But I thought the entree was gonna come out sooner than what it did and so I kind of sat around and only had like one plate of the actual like self-serve food. I had like three, probably my fault. Yeah, um, so I think that was a little bit of a problem. By the time the actual entree came out, I was already like my food had settled and I wasn't super hungry. I didn't eat all my food. I kind of just picked at it, which that was unfortunate. Um, but it was I don't think good. it was bad. I think it was really good though. I really enjoyed my steak. That was really good. Yeah. yeah. That was her day, that and we hope you guys had fun. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. Yes, but we will talk to you later. See you soon. And that's what's going down. Bye. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs>